Bangladesh has. I am so not dressed right. It is cold here. I got on flip flops like it's warm, but I'm gonna make the best of my little 24 hours in Cleveland. I just arrived the veg fest is at the convention center in downtown cleveland ohio um if people don't know i'm actually from cleveland ohio born and raised so my trip here was to come see family and then also a double a double dip because the veg fest was this weekend so i wasn't vegan when i lived here so it's an opportunity for me to see what the vegan scene is like in cleveland i'm excited to see what it's like for some reason because I mean, I wasn't researching it when I lived here, but I don't recall there being like a huge vegan type scene or vegan restaurants or things of that nature. So I'm excited to see what Cleveland has to offer for vegan food. Hopefully it's pretty good. So we're about to go in here and see what's up. Was 
enjoyable. I won't say all the food was enjoyable, but I enjoyed myself overall. You know, I haven't been here in a really long time. Well, it's been like three years. That roll, that little hand roll, the ahi tuna that was made out of tomato, delicious. I wish I could have went back and got more, but it was free, so it's not like I could just go buy it because I would eat that. That was really yummy. I always love sushi, and vegan sushi is pretty tasty if you ask me. But now I'm about to go ahead and see some family, kind of catch up with, you know, my friends and family here that I haven't seen in a while. So that's the plan. So this used to be my old neighborhood, Cedar Lee, Cleveland Heights. That was my high school over there. It looks a whole lot different from when I went there. I'm gonna ride by my high school and I'm gonna go by my house that I used to live in. This is nostalgic. Oh look, Cleveland Heights High School. Damn, that shit look different. I'm here to see my grandmother watch. I bet you as soon as I hit this corner, she gonna be looking outside the door waiting for me. Watch, watch. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> hey, grandma. Hello, Grandma. Hello, baby, baby, baby. Give me a little kissy, kissy. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Grandma. How you doing? Nicole? Good. <laughs> Look at your gray hair. Gray? It's all the way gray. Uh -huh. Hi, Grandma. <laughs> you look so cute. That's what. That's what I'm saying. And the thing about it, and see, men know, especially when a man, a man know that that's what a woman is looking for. And all they do is push them away. And I tell you, how, and, and, and I tell you how, how, if you notice that, do you have you noticed how these celebrities you know, they be man people with, you know, you you you, you, you have you noticed what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Even in all of that, they got all this. They, the majority of them don't end up staying together. Very very few because even if they make it, even if they make an X amount of dollars, so it ain't about what you can give me. It's about if you love me, cause if you really, cause if a person really love you, it ain't nothing they gonna do for you, baby. And that's the most important thing. I don't wanna be in love and broke. <laughs> well, well, I tell you what, you can be, you can, you can be out of love and still broke. Cause if the Lord don't yeah. take care of you, if the Lord don't take care of you, see, if the Lord don't take care of you, you don't, you, you don't, um, you don't make it no way. But you ought to talk to men sometimes. You'd mm -hmm. be surprised. Oh my lord. That I was telling yeah, you. They about women. They, 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 you'd be surprised how they think. I was think reading an article about And how they think mm -hmm. about women. You know, and I, that's what I was telling her. And and and, and 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 the concept that women have, you know what I mean? Even about themselves and, and dressing modest and all of that. My grandmother is the cutest. I just had to take a little nap. I was tired. But it's just so fun talking to her and just sitting there and talking to my aunt. Like, priceless moments. So worth the trip. But now I'm about to go find some food because I'm hungry and I'm thirsty. I had, I don't even think I had a sip of water. I didn't get anything to drink at the festival. So I'm hungry, I'm thirsty. <laughs> do one little taste bite before I pull off I feel like I gotta taste it before I leave so I got my smoothie it's called a TLC that's all I know oh my god that's yummy oh yes oh this is so good mm. all right let me see what the sandwich looks like Mmm, a little dipping sauce on the side. It's nice and saucy. Mmm. Oh, yes. Oh, that's yummy. Oh, my gosh. I, yeah, it's a mess. 
and I want to be comfortable when I eat so but that is really good oh I'm so I'm so happy this is good I'm about to go enjoy it so it's day two in Cleveland just leaving my grandmother's place she's so cute she wanted to cook me breakfast she wanted to cook me some food so bad I'm like no grandma I'm good uh-uh grandma I'm good what do you eat what can you eat what you want for breakfast I'm like I got it because you're gonna slide some butter or something up in there and then the whole meal is ruined but it's cute you know family don't really understand what it's like to be vegan what you eat what you don't eat and how to cook and what you're gonna eat and all of that type of stuff so I just got the little vegan lecture and all of that type of stuff this morning how you gonna find a man <laughs> my grandmother is hilarious but so in the midst of that I decided well I'm gonna go get me some vegan brunch I found a place on the west side of Cleveland that I'm gonna go check out so that's where we are headed to see what the vegan food is like in these Cleveland streets what's going on in these vegan Cleveland streets we about to find out I drove all the way over here and they're closed for some reason like this is where we were trying to go the earth bistro online it shows that they're open till three and then I get here and they're closed Womp, womp, womp. Now I need to figure out a plan B. Cilantro, lime rice, tofu, a Thai peanut sauce with some cucumber and an Asian slaw. I had such a good little weekend. I only stayed here for about a day and a half, but I got to spend time with my grandmother and my aunts and, you know, see my family, drive around the neighborhood, you know, check out the city. That was about all I needed to be in Cleveland, but I did enjoy myself and, you know, it was good. Until next time, Cleveland. <laughs>